Hey, how's it going? And today I'm going to show you how to create a growing mold or growing fungus effect. It's pretty cool and very easy to do. And we're just going to come up to model and I'll go to geometry and I'm going to get a cube and just go OK. I'm going to back out here a little bit. Control space and search for rust on ground. This one right here. We didn't used to be able to do this. <laughs> and I'll just position it like this. One thing I want to do is go into lights and change the distant light from distant to ambient. And then what we're going to do is go in the surface editor, go into edit node graph, come over here. We're going to go into 3D textures and go to procedural, double click this. We're going to go from turbulence to dented. And then we're going to put color into color and bump into bump. We're going to double click into this. I'll just leave the colors like this for now. These can be changed though. Come to options here and you'll see we have a scale and power. We click on the E to go into the graph editor. I'll make this big. We can select this key right here and select that key frame right there. I'm going to change the value from 4 to 0. Come here, get the add a keyframe. Doesn't matter where I click. And now it changed the frame to 120. And we can leave the value at 4. Press A to see the whole graph. So it's going to change from 0 to 4 over the course of 120 frames. Come back in here and click power. Go ahead and click this. Select that keyframe. Set that value to zero. Get the add keyframe here. On its frame, change it to 120. And change the value to five. Press A if you want to see it. Now, if you ever create a graph and you're sorry you did, just hit shift and left click and it'll clear it out. And that's all we have to do. So let's see what this looks like. I got to go into, let's match my camera perspective and we'll go into VPR and I'll hit play. Cool, huh? Now one thing we can do is, let me change the color here. So I can change the color to red or something to make it look cooler. And there we go. So this could be like a block of cheese or some alien thing that's taking over the planet or somebody's face. And you can adjust all those values. So anyway, that's all I have for today. Take care. Have a great day. And I'll talk to you next time.